and just uh, poking its nose uh, from uh, behind one of the radiators on the International Space Station is uh, the shuttle Discovery, almost at a point 655 feet behind the International Space Station in the upper left-hand corner of your screen is the uh, Soyuz vehicle, one of the Soyuz spacecraft uh, docked to the Russian segment of the International Space Station and a good view of Discovery as Kevin Ford continues his uh, radial fly around of the complex. On the right side of your screen, the Zvezda service module docked uh, to the aft of Zvezda, the Progress 34 cargo craft. Nestled back into the rear of the cargo bay of Discovery, the Leonardo multipurpose logistics module that was filled with two and a half tons of items no longer needed on the International Space Station after delivering almost nine tons of science racks, assembly hardware, and other supplies for the Expedition 20 crew. Discovery now passing directly behind the International Space Station, about uh, to begin a transit uh, to a point 630 feet directly below the station. The propulsion officer here in Mission Control reports that Kevin Ford is uh, right on his marks in terms of propellant usage. Discovery and the International Space Station approaching the west coast of South America, soon to cross directly over La Paz, Bolivia. Altitude 223 statute miles, Discovery 644 feet away from the station.
Discovery Houston on air to ground two, FYI, the station's maneuvering to the TEA attitude. Okay, we copy, uh, Houston. Thanks for that, Kevin. Now. Houston on air to ground two for the radar data. Go ahead, Houston. Okay, we'll take uh, spec 33, item 16, and then uh, sometime after the uh, plus R bar, we're hoping to uh, take a look at the data and start taking it to set up for the SEP 1 burn. Pat's going to give you item 16 right now, and then we'll stand by for your call on the next radar data. With a pallet of puffy clouds providing a backdrop, Shuttle Discovery, 652 feet uh, below the International Space Station as the two craft approach the west coast of South America. You can see a good view here of the uh, orbiter boom sensor system, the 50-foot-long boom extension uh, mated to the shuttle's robotic arm. That will come into play uh, a, a few hours from now when Kevin Ford, Pat Forrester, and Jose Hernandez work uh, the procedures for the so-called late inspection of the reinforced carbon-carbon on the leading edges of Discovery's wings and its nose cap. This late inspection providing one final set of imagery uh, through the laser systems and the cameras on the end of the orbiter boom sensor system for the imagery experts to provide to the mission management team for final clearance of Discovery's heat protection shield for entry and landing back at the Kennedy Space Center on Thursday evening.